Welcome to our living room. This is From the Disney Couch. We are finishing off the quest for the ultimate Disney movie with the no bonus round. round. We've already picked our favorite pet movies and Animal Universe movies, but now it's time to let the boys play. Yes, it's the boy hero movie category. And you know what? What? We tend to think of Disney as princess movies, but honestly, there are some amazing contenders in this category. This is our largest category. We've oh, got wow. Pinocchio, Peter Pan, The Sword in the Stone, Black Cauldron, <laughs> But then Aladdin, The Hunchback of Notre Dame, Hercules, Tarzan, The Emperor's New Groove, the funniest Disney movie out there, honestly, Atlantis, The Lost Empire, Treasure Planet, Meet the Robinsons, Wreck-It Ralph, and then Big Hero 6. How are we going to decide? It's tough. Now, I need to stop you here for a second because some people might be wondering, Excuse me, what the heck is Aladdin doing out here? It's a princess movie! <laughs> Jasmine is one of the official Disney princesses. Yeah, it's true. Jasmine does show up with all her fellow sister princesses, but we had to make an executive decision and put Aladdin in this category instead of the princess category. It was a hard decision. It was. Why? Um, no, it's Aladdin. The story is really about him. Obviously, Jasmine is in there and does some cool stuff, and she's got some problems and things that she needs to solve, but really, the main plot of the story is about Aladdin having to figure out his life. Yeah, you'll see yeah. what all these movies have in common, is they have a male protagonist who's going through adventures, and sometimes he falls in love, but really, the movie's about him. Right. So, that's why we decided to put Aladdin here, even though Princess Jasmine shows up there and yeah, so we're not cutting Jasmine from the princess team, okay? Mm -hmm. She's still on the team, but Aladdin takes it for boy hero movie. Mm -hmm. Okay, so without further ado, this is going to be hard. We need to pick our favorites. So we're going to write them down and reveal our votes right away. Okay, Disney Couch, let's reveal our votes for our favorite boy hero movie. Three, two, one, go! We've got Big Hero 6, Aladdin, Aladdin, and Tarzan! So, there were some amazing movies on here. It, it was really hard to narrow it down to my favorite, but I think I had to go back to how the movie emotionally resonated with me. Mm, and yeah. as a mother, this one really resonated with me because you'll be in my heart. And Happy yeah. Mother's Day. Oh, and yeah, it's Mother's Day today. And also, I really enjoy the character of Jane. I think she's just such a spunky female uh, character in this movie. And I love the Phil Collins soundtrack. Yes, I am a product of the 80s. And so, yeah, Phil Collins has my heart too. <laughs> Yeah, and I remember as we were watching Tarzan on the Disney couch, just really, really enjoying it, and... It's a great movie! And so Tarzan was one of my runners-up. It's sure. my pick. Alright, Ellie, what do you have? I chose Aladdin, because everybody knows and loves Aladdin. It's such a good movie, like, it's such a classic, like... The songs are amazing, and like, the story, and all the characters, and this is such a Disney movie. Like, it's just... Watch Aladdin. I also chose Aladdin because it's a classic to me. It is. It has all the ingredients. Uh, I love the humor in it. Love the characters, the adventure. Um, yeah, it's it's just good. So I was I was kind of down between Aladdin or Wreck It Ralph. These were my two picks, and I was really torn between the two. And then I thought, you know, if there was only one movie between these two that I could watch again for the rest of my life, which one would it be? And that put Aladdin up to the top for me. That's a good criteria. So Aladdin gets my bonus point. Alright! Yo, yo, woo, woo, woo. Big Hero 6, guys. Mm. What a movie. Yeah. You can't help but fall in love with every single character in this movie. It's got... It's I don't know, Cray. <laughs> 
But even Kray is like a very oh. complex villain, and you can see his Mr. motivations. Kray. No, Callahan. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Anyway, yes. <clears throat> Um, Baymax is so iconic and lovable, you just walk in with a big hug. And also they deal with really complex issues like grief, and they handle them really well and really yeah. realistically. And I also love Hero, like, when this movie came out, I was 14, Hero was 14, one time I dreamt I had a massive crush on him. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad they didn't have Hero come out of Disney Parks. Oh, that would be great. Yeah, why don't they have Baymax? Yeah! yeah. Baymax would be a great meet. Anyway. Character. Sorry. This movie really resonated with me, makes you laugh, makes you cry, makes you cry a lot. It's, like, it really just makes you feel really deeply for all the characters, and I think it really is number one in my heart. Okay. Those are our ones that get the bonus points. So let's put them on the chart. Aladdin gets two bonus points. Tarzan gets one bonus point. And Big Hero 6 gets one bonus point. There we go. So if you've got a favorite from the Boy Hero category, why don't you leave it down in the comments below if enough of the same movie gets uh, voted on, then it may just get an extra bonus point. People's Choice Awards. Okay, well that wraps up our boy hero category. Up next, it's time for the princesses. Yay! So thanks for joining us from the Disney couch. Like, share, and subscribe so you don't miss the exciting conclusion of the quest for the ultimate Disney movie. We'll see you next time. Bye! Bye. Now can we watch the